again, continuing with the light. So purgatory, I, I just, I just, I love, I love Dahlia. Okay, I was like, I don't know where you're going with this. It could be a lot of it, things. It could be a lot of things. So I really, I am trying to currently figure out how I can locate Chatswin and move them. Right? I, you know, one of our uh, reporter friends uh, made a joke that Pawnee and like Chatswin are like cousins. Like, like sister town and I'm like I want dual citizenship I want to move to both of those places I've got no problems with that I just that. Um, but yes I I love Chatswin I kind of want to live there even if they're kind of crazy and ridiculous and whatever but Dahlia you know Dahlia is one of those characters that yes is probably best in smaller doses because if she was you know the lead for everything it'd be a little ridiculous but at the same time I just when they use her right, and they use her right, I think probably like ninety-seven percent of the time, she's fantastic. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, Carly is amazing. You know, the it was great seeing her have a little bit of we, what the episode that actually saw for the table read up mm -hmm. when she had some self doubts about her not being good enough as Tessa, and then you know that whole dance off, amazing. And I just am newly obsessed with her wanting to become a Jew. <laughs> in an episode and you know just the you know the line had been spoiled and but the kugel i just i really just want to talk about kugel all the time now because and in closing kugel right and i think because, you should because i, I think mean, that like there will be people that get it and then it's awesome and then there will be people who just think you're crazy but that's also kind of awesome because then you've appropriated the quirk for yourself and yes. they'll just credit you with it. And also it makes me really want to eat Kugel because Kugel oh, is good. Okay. <laughs> it's also good. So thank you for that, Emily. Um, but no, I just, I'm really impressed. Cause you know, a show in second season is never, it's always a difficult tonally thing to have in season two. I mean, we've talked in depth about other shows that have struggled in season two and I feel like the Purgatory hasn't really hit the mistakes that a lot of other shows do it's still an enjoyable half an hour I there's just only been like one episode that I've been a little bit questionable at the season but I just I really I just, Dahlia is fantastic so I like the little burst we get of her and it makes me happy so thank you Subvergatory yay 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 <laughs> So those were happy and joyful. It's joyful this time, which is surprising, surprising for us. Yeah. So yeah, yes. this was We Have Thoughts. I'm Danielle at Danielle TBD. I'm Marissa at Marissa Rockman. And we'll do some more of these next time. Yeah, thank you for listening to our crazy.